Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to understand the demonstration of dynamic traffic control using here API. This is one of the important project in Python and it is based on the here API. So as far as the here API is concerned, it is an API service which uh, uh, gives us the traffic data of particular city or particular we can say the chalk or particular area or the particular coordinate points using the satellites and it is a real-time system where we can select any chalk or any uh, location or any coordinate system or coordinate points and at that coordinate whatever is the exact traffic at this time it is giving the real-time feed and this is happening through the satellites for that purpose here.com is one of the uh, platform and from that we have taken this api called here api and that is used in this project so here what is happening so as per as the present situation of traffic is concerned or the traffic light signals are concerned they are fixed for example they are having 15 second delay constantly and that is actually causing the traffic jam or congestion in the traffic so in order to solve this problem we are having this dynamic traffic control system and for that purpose we are considering the real-time data from the here api so let's see the demonstration so first of all the programming language used in this particular project is python and uh, the framework which is used to design the web application is flask framework and in the front end side we are using html and css to create or to build that web application so once the project is in running we have to go on the browser and we'll type localhost colon 5000 then the username is admin and the password is also admin to log into this system so there is one fixed uh, user id and password so once we log in so we'll be on this page and here you have to put the location now first of all uh, i need to uh, mention the location let's say i will put katras pune now this is the location in the Pune and now after I submit it will find out the coordinates of this location automatically. So this is the coordinates the latitude and longitude of this Katraj Pune and also it will fetch the complete address of that particular whatever I was just typing it will be searched and the complete proper address will be given or it will be returned over here. Secondly it will find out the location on the map as well which location I am considering. So I am considering this location and there are these major roads which are here and these uh, for the traffic will calculate the traffic for these important roads now once i click on traffic data so i will get the complete traffic map over here so now this is the that choke uh, the katra choke which can say in the pune or which will say and these are the four different roads so here the green uh, things are nothing but the lesser traffic the yellow is considering or if you consider this yellow road is having the heavy traffic and secondly uh, the raid will be extremely high traffic so that way just like uh, google map or the um, uh, google navigation system marks the roads by red green and uh, uh, orange color in the same way we are marking the uh, roads with different colors and now it has identified these major uh, uh, the roads and their corresponding traffics data is available over here for this road the jump factor is 4.5 the current average speed of this particular uh, or the vehicles on this road is this much and the free flow speed so free flow speed is the speed which is the speed of vehicles or the traffic when uh, there is no traffic or no heavy traffic and now this is the current so it is reduced so that's why there is jump factor but if they are let's say if you can say that this 24.11 and 27 so these two fields are quite similar to the jump factors also less so that means so whenever the jump factor is high that road is having the heavy traffic and if the jump factor is low that means that traffic is not having that much traffic that's a simple meaning now based on this data we will try to uh, modulate the signal we will try to control the traffic signal as per our own way and that is the traffic control so once i click on the traffic control now the signals will start uh, or getting control as per our calculation now the first road which is having the 4.38 jump factor which is very high and the current speed of vehicles is 17.5 and the free flow speed is 26 so it is it has been reduced so that's why the jump factor is very high so for this we should give large green signal time so 27 seconds are allocated for this signal but for the second signal where the jump factor is less 
so the only nine seconds are given to this particular cell. so after nine seconds this will change and again for this nine seconds are allocated so again this will be there for nine seconds and again for this signal as the jump factor is 1.97 so 12 seconds so instead of giving fixed times for example 15 seconds 15 seconds 15 seconds and 15 seconds to all signals what we are doing here as the jump factor is high we are giving 27 seconds green time here the traffic is less so we'll giving we are giving 9 seconds green time again here the traffic is less so its jump factor is 1.52 and its jump factor is 1.53 so almost same so the green signal time is same for these two and for this the jump factor is 1.97 so green signal time is 12 seconds so we are actually what we are doing based on the uh, traffic intensity we are controlling the green signal delay so the road having the highest traffic will be given highest time the road having minimum traffic will be given minimum time and the uh, combination of all this time 27 plus 9 plus 9 plus 12 will count to 60 seconds so generally what happens 15 seconds are allocated so 15 15 15 so 15 pose are 60 here what we are doing again the 60 second is constant but it is now divided as per the traffic so that's all about the complete uh, implementation of this particular project in case you need the code or any kind of support regarding this particular project you can check the description box thank you